Hundreds of thousands of people are expected to attend the full return of Pittsburgh St. Patrick's Day Parade tomorrow. And with a large crowd and bad weather, we have a lot to talk about. Yeah, Pittsburgh Public Safety reminding people to make safe, smart decisions. KDK's Royce Jones is live with some precautions you might want to take. Royce. Yeah, you guys, well, on average, more than 350,000 people attend this parade, making it one of the biggest in the country and also creating quite an undertaking for police and EMS. And when you come down here tomorrow, you will notice a heavy police presence from the city, county and state, too. And they'll be monitoring crowds for underage drinking, public intoxication and drinking and driving. They'll be all around downtown and other party destinations like the South Side and the North Shore as well. Light towers will even be used to help keep security tight and open container laws will be strictly enforced. Public safety also wants people to make sure that they have a DD, use public transportation or ride share apps to be as safe as you can be on the roads tomorrow. Meanwhile, organizers are ready to welcome people back from all over the world for this major event. It's a destination parade. People come to Pittsburgh from all over the country. They're probably originally from Pittsburgh. Last year in the September parade, uh, I met a guy at the end of the parade. Uh, he came up and we spoke and he was from Dublin, Ireland. And he and his family were at the parade and they said it's the best parade they've ever seen. Which is actually really true, too, because in years past, I've also met people at the parade who are from Ireland and a ton of other different places around the world, and they all love it and have actually said, even people from Ireland, that it is better than any St. Patrick's Day that they've experienced over there. So it's pretty cool. By the way, the parade starts tomorrow at 10 a.m. right here where we're standing at Liberty and 11th downtown. Reporting live, Royce Jones, KDKA News.